Deuce it. Fuck you, Jim. Ooh, let's go. Nice little triple. No, bro. How did he survive? What's good, YouTube? I am doing well. My name is Monster J. And today we're going to be playing some more Phantom Forces. And today the weapon we're going to be reviewing is the foul now the foul the foul power is shorty specifically because it has the most buff out of all the foul family so as you may know as you may know in the testing place they did buff the foul family a bit and for the foul power of shorty they did really buff damage up a bit that they they honestly just broken the foul power to the point where it can literally two shot in CQC up to over 45 stuff, which, which is insane. With the body multiple with the body multiplier and the maximum damage, it could go up to 51 damage, bro. 51 freaking damage, bro, in CQC, bro. This thing gets freaking shred, bro. Like it's honestly kind of scary, bro. But the my, the maximum damage is kind of short, but I can live with it though. It doesn't really matter though. And um, I think they did reduce the recoil of it too for the foul para, so. It's, it's, it's just genuinely a lot better than it was before because before before the before the buff it does have like a really high recoil because you know it's a high cop it shoots high caliber ammo that's understandable because usually high caliber ammo weapons generally have high recoil but they kind of they, they kind of did reduce that they, they reduced the recoil it makes it shoot a lot smoother so the attachment that I'm using for the for the foul pair of shorty is reflex comp center stubby and full stock which is great for reducing recoil and and um just make it shoot a bit more accurate. And I just want to show you how powerful this foul parachute is at CPC because it can. Oh yeah, and and it reloads like a breeze too. So oh my god, I th I think the whole server's in trouble with this one. Like generally, like why why would why would you give why would you give the foul so much power, dude? Like honestly, bro. Like it all, like it's, it's already good before before the buff. Now they decide to buff it and makes it even stronger. Like that is genuinely insane, bro. Oh my god, I can't aim. My aim is a potato. My aim is literally a potato. Oh shoot! I literally just hopped over the stairs. How embarrassing! Man. Weird version. Oh my god, you shred that guy. But anyways, this is a weird version. Of I just shred that next guy. This is a weird version of freaking Mirage. Bro. Like this is this is low key kind of kind of freaking weird to be honest. But I'm vibing with it though. I'm vibing with it. Hey, be out here, man. Let's go, boys. I see you. Oh, it's all good. It sucks. He's about to be my next kill. Better than dying, though. I'll say that. The thing that sets back the para a little bit is the fact that it only has a round in a mag. So generally, you wouldn't be shooting like it. It really does have a high consumption rate, but gen but it's still really good though. The, the pros really does weigh out the cons in this one. I think it was already low. To be fair, it was already low. Oh man, I was gonna kill that guy. I probably would have been dead. But I am out here. I am out here just slaying this guy, bro. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna be trying to I have to use up the foul para uh, for a little, a little bit. Yeah, after the foul shorty, we're gonna be using a foul para. Right now, I'm just popping off, dude. Holy crap, it's a grenade. Right now, I'm just popping off, dude. Like, this thing is generally a... In close to medium range, bro, it actually performs really well. I mean, before the buff... The problem with the foul pair of shorty is this recoil. It has a very harsh recoil, both horizontal and vertical. But now that they reduced the recoil, it, it performs... It, it just excels a lot better. And maybe potentially this might be good at longer ranges as well. The hell 
why do you fall down the elevator shaft? Where the hell did he went? Oh, you look at that hill down there. So now we're going to use the Foul 50.63 para, which is honestly a really good carbine, I would say. I love using it. I have been using it for a while. I already got like 600 kills of it. And the uh, attachments that I'm using is Coyote Sight, Compensator, Pistol Grip, and Full Stock. And that's a maximum damage of 44 and a minimum damage of 23, which is honestly really impressive. Uh, damage range can, uh, I think, with the, with the Torso Multiplier and the maximum damage, it can three shot over 55 studs, but can't, but probably can two shot kill headshot. Three shot kill maximum range, four shot kill minimum range. Uh, pretty 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 solid to be honest. But yeah, I love I love using I love using using this thing a lot. And the uh, attachments that I'm using for it is the coyote sight, compensator, pistol grip, and full stock. Generally. This, that, the attachment that I'm using is great for reducing recoil, and the uh, have a bit of rotational recoil, which means that the sight tends to rock back and forth. So to reduce that, I just slap on a pistol grip because it's good for reducing rotational recoil, and I'm, I'm, I'm upset. I mean, compared to foul peril in a testing place, and in a the actual game has a much harder recoil. Than a testing game. Like, I'm generally in love with the recoil in the testing game the actual game because compared to the actual game, it has a harsh recoil. And, it, and it's just generally annoying to deal with, and I'm glad they, they reduced it. I'm just generally Ooh, let's go. Nice little triple. No, bro! How did he survive? That was a nice little quad feed though, but you could have been dead though. We got lucky. Alright, sit down. I mean, same problem with the foul. We have a high consumption rate and uh, 20, 20 ammo in the magazine. But, at, but both of them actually has a conversion where it gives you 30, 30, 30, 30 rounds in the magazine. But in exchange, but, in, but the trade-off is really penalizing in, redu in exchange for reducing like both both maximum and minimum damage. So I do like using the conversion a bit, but it does it doesn't really give give that. It's not really as powerful without as without the conversion. I would say it's really it's really better for like accuracy. I would say, but focus on more damage. And I will just say, just take the um, you're better off without the conversion. But to be honest, I can't. It's not that bad. It does reduce the recoil quite a bit. Yeah, but the. But. The buff? The buff on the foul is generally a lot better. I love it. Compared to the actual game, the testing game, the testing game foul pair is a lot better. I'm going 43 and 6, bro. That is not bad. I am destroying right now. Well, kind of. I'm just doing well. I'm not destroying. to see how the point forty five conversion does. What it does is that it decreased both maximum and minimum damage. It decreased the minimum damage by a little bit, but it decreased the maximum damage. And um, it gives it it gives the ammo capacity 
over 50 over 50 magazine you can see like the drum you can see like the drum on a foul 50 uh 50 round magazine and a and 150 reserve ammo so i expect this gun to slap and the fact that it it decreases minimum damage but it's probably not gonna be a problem all right probably gonna be like a freaking machine gun dude Follow pair of point forty five conversion go. -da 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 -da. That was lame. I got a. That was lame. I got a spot. Bro, where are people at though? Like I'm trying to get some keys. <laughs> this thing barely has any vertical recoil, but it has some horizontal recoil or rotational at least. But I got pistol bolts, so it should be fine. Does it reload too? Does it reload too fast or too slow? Ooh. Bro, like the point forty five conversion is actually nice. The, the, the recoil is actually not that bad. Bro, oh my god, bro. Oh my, if, if I if I just looked over there, I would have gotten more, bro. Oh god. Bro, I, I did not realize I was going to do this good with the para point forty five conversion. It's just honestly insane, bro. Especially with, with the amount of ammo that it has and the low recoil. Just generally just makes this weapon a freaking living nightmare, dude. Bro, you could just think, you could just shoot this thing for days and you'll just freaking just be beaming people, bro. Like this, this conversion is honestly really good. I know that I know it's in a real game, but I never actually tried it. It's and especially with and especially with the buff that the that stylus did on the foul just makes the point forty five even better. Okay, so another update that stylus has made onto on into the testing place is that they they rec they recently like you know improved the like the night that that night vision like. That that night that night vision optic, you know, when, you, when you're like everything's like green when you're scoping. Yeah, I, yeah, I already got it. Cool. All right, we didn't have to buy it, so I'm gonna, we're gonna see how how this looks now, especially on the sniper because I think it, the night vision on the sniper does look super clean. I mean, if it was in an actual game, I would probably use it. But all, but all these updates that they're doing are going to be added into Halloween, so. Ooh. Ooh. It kind of looks clean, though, not going to lie. I like, I like how, I like the night vision vibes, though. Like, some, like, some of the, like, some of the parts, like, really highlight it, and it looks really cool. Boom. Oh my god. I'm actually hitting my shots with this thing, bro. I'm surprised. I genuinely thought I was gonna miss like all my shots using this optic, but it's actually the other way around. And I'm ha and I'm super happy for that. Oh my god, I'm scared of crap! I am close to reaching rank 100, so maybe after I'm done using the 
night vision optic, I will go on to the real game, game, and I'll freaking, and I'll freaking like rank up in, in the actual game, so my so my data will save. All right, so we are in the actual game, as you can see by my XP bar, that I am close to rank 100. So I don't know what I'm gonna be doing as I rank up to 100. I'm, I'm just probably I'm just probably gonna get regular kills. Two special, just some snipe shots, boom, boom, and rank up to rank 100, baby. Honestly, I should have been, I should have been, but I don't know. I'm playing my alts more than I play my main, which is kind of weird. Oh, I suck. Maybe I need those night vision goggles. That's what helps me hit my shots a lot more. Oh, oh, I just ranked up. That's what I just realized. Let's go, boys. Rank 100. Well, that's all for tonight's video. If you want me to review in any other guns or just want me to just, you know, play Phantom Forces, comment down below. And also, I have a Patreon up for you guys to show me some extra support. All of that will be in the description below. And as always, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.